Hey guys, how you doing? Hope you're having an awesome day. Mike here from virtualrealityoasis.com and today is going to be the final episode of Elevator to the Moon. So I've really enjoyed playing this series. Um, I know it's not been the most popular series on my channel but it's kind of one of those games that I really just wanted to finish because I was intrigued where it all goes in the end. So this is going to be the final episode. There is actually two endings so I'm going to cover both endings and I'll put in the description down below uh, the uh, timings for both endings so you can jump straight to the endings if you want to see it that way. So without further Without further ado, let's dive in. Okay guys, welcome back to Elevator. Please make your selection. Excuse me, I'm talking right now. Welcome guys to Elevator to the Moon, and this is going to be episode number four, so we're going to jump straight to it. There was some crazy stuff going on where Rockmire was launching a rocket into our elevator to the moon, which was super not cool. So let's find out what Access that was all about. Granted. Please prepare to enjoy this elevating experience. You repaired the elevator and made your approach into a dormant asteroid in space, the Rock. Inside, you stumbled upon a dead astronaut, Rockmire. The truth is, President Rockmire is a clone. Then events start to take a sudden turn. Vida now exists only on Hefty Boy, and Rockmire revealed his plan B, a space shuttle crash. Okay. Lies? Well, my whole life has been a lie. Your lies. President Doug Slater Rothmeyer, you're not a hero. You're a clone. That's true. Fail? Ooh, I don't think so, Dum Dum. Check out the window, because here comes Plan B. Oh, my cash. Oh, man. All my money. My dreams. Oh, which one shall I choose? No, oh. he's lying. He's the one who's lying oh. this entire time. Oh, I've got to go for this helmet. No, Pat. Ah, I can breathe done? again. You know what? You both deserve each other. Bye, Vida. Bye, yes, yes. Vida. I'm finally rid of you, Vida. My plan worked. It really fucking worked. Oh, <laughs> yeah, that's right. Ah, the swear field is still on. But I don't care. I'm so fucking happy right now. <laughs> Yeah. What's the matter with you? Hey, hey, stay alive! We're not done! Pilot! Pilot! Oh no. What's going on? Oh good, you're waking oh. up. Looks like you were put on ice while your suit guided you here. <laughs> you almost made it. <laughs> ah, okay. Oh look, it's a cute little hefty bot. Hey there, little guy. He's so cute. We're gonna use you to build a new elevator. Hooray! Uh, yeah. Let's, uh, let's do that then. Uh, this one? Oh, okay. Uh, ooh. Where was that? I think that was here, actually. And then... This one was here, maybe? I think that's right. Yay! Sound. Is there something wrong with the refrigerator? Oh. Well, we've got a nice shiny ah, rocket one. That is way too broken. You need to think of something fast. You're using the shuttle pieces? Uh, I could have thought of that. I just didn't. <laughs> uh, oh, we got other pieces now. So this one, I think, goes here with the little trash chute. Uh, Bro, I don't know where these parts go. I'm just talking to you so you don't get so lonely. Thank you. That's very, very kind of you, dude. Right, this one goes here, I think. They say in space, no one can this hear one you goes... scream. Ah! Did you hear that? <laughs> ah, that is bullshit. Yeah, I heard that. Here? I hope that's right. Not bad, not bad. Yeah. Now the android is calling in more parts for you to use. Oh, okay. I've got to build the rest. So, well, that definitely goes near the door. So dear. Uh, this one. Ah uh, man, are you really sure that it goes there? Yes. 
This one goes here. This one goes here. Uh, oh, it looks really messed up. It's not messed up, dude. It's that's right. I think it goes here. It looks. Let's see. Yeah, that looks nice. Uh, oh, no. That does not go there. I think this one goes there. I remember the hatch being there. There? Yeah? Is that right? Yeah, yeah puzzles better. are fun! <laughs> yeah, they sure are. Uh, this one? Nice! Nice, dude. Right. That should be the last piece. That should be, that should be right. There you go. Oh, there's one more piece. Ah, uh, this one. Gonna elevate it back together. Do not fall until we're on the moon. Right. Let's put a lid on this tin can. Thank you. Oh my god, elevator back together. Nice work, bro. Now hit that go button. Let's go to the moon. Let's do it. It's okay, little hefty. We'll be okay. Caution. I promise. Please reduce elevator speed to avoid imminent death. The elevator, it, it's going too fast. Something's wrong. <laughs> what? It can't be. That's impossible. <laughs> no, <laughs> Norman. Norman. I killed you, man. The the I killed you, dude. Or something. Oh, five, six, seven. Uh, this one. Oh, uh, this one. No. Oh God, he's so friggin' annoying. I know, Make right? I'm trying. Kill him. Oh, okay. Hold on. Ooh. Go on. It's a trap! Oh. Be careful! He's using his flash to stun you! Okay. Oh! You need to suck him into the trash! Okay, okay! I know! Uh... Yeah, I know that won't work! He's moving too fast! Okay. Right. Come on. Uh, Take this, way. punk. Oh. You need to look away when he attacks you. Oh man. Right. Okay. We're ready this time. Look away. Yeah! Suck it, noob! It's working! He's getting weaker! Look away! Now smoke him in the face! Good, good! Keep it up! He's getting faster! That can only mean one thing! He's, He's almost weaker. dead! Yeah! Yeah, have some of that. I don't need you anymore. Gang bro. Finish him. Ooh! That was fast. Finish him. Yes. See you later, dude. It's not slowing down. Just hold on to something! Uh, it's gonna crash! Oh no! Oh no! Impact in three, two, 
Yay! So now you can pull the party lever. Let's celebrate. Uh, okay. <gasps> yeah. Yeah. Horse dance. I was enjoying the party there. What's going on? So the elevator is in pieces, but it doesn't matter. Look, you made it, and I can still see you. That means the world can still see you. Check it out. Yeah, I just printed out this photo album for you. I sent it through the vent. Where? It's probably fallen on the floor. Oh, yeah, it has. Yeah. Moon mission memories. See? Look at these photos. Uh... They all think I stole the elevator, but no, it was you. <laughs> My camera has been transmitting footage this entire time. So wait, time. I'm your like Everyone clone then. Everyone thinks that I'm so brave. The poles, they're exploding. I delivered my promise. I thought I was more like your father, but we're like brothers, like twins. One handsome rock mire to rule the earth. Yeah. The other one, <laughs> well, that can be you. Yeah, we're, I'm a clone I mean, of you. It's not like I can get you back even if I wanted. That's but a don't shame. Don't worry, I'll be president of the Earth, and you can stay here and be president of the friggin' moon. How awesome is that? That is pretty awesome. I don't mind being the president of the moon. It's okay, I got a plan B. I'm unlocking the syringe for you. You need to take this drug. You go. Oh. Okay, so take the awesome drug. Come uh. on, it'll be the last, I mean, it'll be the best thing that you ever do. I don't know. It's freaking mind blowing. Take it. Don't do drugs, kids. That's what I say. It's like a brain medicine. <sighs> okay, so you've taken it. Do you feel like someone just playing a, a virtual reality game yet? Take Fun. off your space helmet, <laughs> and, and then the hallucination will kick in. I am playing a it's video a game. Convincing hallucination. Don't worry, I'll start repeating everything again and again from here on out. So that way, it feels more like a video game, you know, to get you in the mood. Thanks to the drug, this reality will feel like a VR game, even in your memories. <laughs> Once you take your helmet off, you'll be on the earth, in a safe place, thinking you just played a crazy VR adventure. I did. What if you're at home, or at work, who knows? The hallucinations are always different, so we just need to take off your space helmet now. Okay, I'll Turn take it. To the real world. I'll take my space helmet off. So in the last episode, it, you get this choice, uh, it's the same level, but obviously I chose to put the helmet on. This time I'm going to choose Vita just to see what the different ending is. Sorry, Rockmire. It's over, Douglas. Your pathetic, egotistical plan has failed. Now, pilot, all is not lost. We can still make it to the moon. Yes. The cryostasis of the suit is beginning automatically. For now, just try and relax. I will. Thank you. Good. You're waking up with strong vitals from cryosleep. Okay. Turns out, all you needed was a nap while your suit guided you here. Very convenient. Love naps. You can use me. I'll work just like Hefty Boy, only stronger. That way... Mm. Excellent. It seems that there was a Hefty Bot that was stored away on the space shuttle. We can use that. Okay, so we just need to build our elevator again. And then we'll be good. I might skip this bit because you've obviously seen this bit already. Finish it. There was your time. Yeah. Hmm. Pilot, I'm putting on the brakes. The elevator will slow down, but it's going to be a bumpy ride. Hang in there. Attempting landing procedure.
Exceptional work, pilot. We made it. Yes. This calls for celebration. You can now pull the party lever behind you. It's the one that says, do not pull till you are on the moon. Uh, okay. We know what happens here. We're gonna have a little party. A little moon party. Yeah. Yeah. feels much better. Oh, hey. My reach is now spreading back across the globe. You saved me, pilot. Now our true work can begin. Activate Project Lazarus. Ooh. Ooh. Ben, this is cool. You and Rockmire are soldiers grown from the same sea. President Rockmire was but a mere puppet, setting a stage for us to cut his strings. You will lead an army of null-minded citizens of the moon, your brothers. You will invade, you will conquer, and you will destroy the Rockmire regime. And go on, shout the first command. Tell your brothers to wake up. Interesting. Oh. Look out the large window. Project Lazarus, that's Face actually me. Sleeping brother. That's me. Wake him up. Wake up! Hey, Clone Rockmire. Wake up! Before the lesser scientist Professor Videl died a martyr, he ascended by creating me in his image. And now, fully connected to his base on the moon, I have evolved. Ooh. I am the collective tree of Videl and the world's knowledge. Autumn is here, and as you fall upon an earth that is turned red in the struggle of this war, you shall be the nutrients from which my forest grows and prospers. Wow. Wake up! Wake up! Wake up! Okay guys, so that is the end of the video and the end of the series of Elevator to the Moon. I really, really enjoyed this title and uh, I hope that more developers jump on this genre. The point and click genre is one of my favourite genres of old. I used to be a real fan of the Monkey Island games for example. So this kind of reminds me of that and it's kind of got a bit of a job simulator twist to it as well. Uh, but it was just a lot of fun and uh, very different from everything else that's available for the Oculus Rift right now. So uh, I had a ton of fun with this one. I'd recommend you guys go and check it out. As I said, it's available on the Oculus Rift and Gear VR. So let me know in the comments down below what you thought of these two different endings, the Rockmire ending and the Vida ending. Which one did you prefer? Leave a like if you like the video, and as always, guys, I'll see you on the next one. Cheers. <laughs>